Good morning, Red Oak Grove, and to all my Facebook listeners. This is the day the Lord has made. We shall rejoice and be glad in it. I was glad when they said unto me, Let us go into the house of the Lord. Our feast shall stand within thy gates, O Jerusalem. Let us pray. O loving and kind Father, we are so thankful for this beautiful Sunday morning that you have blessed us, that we may come together to worship thee in spirit and in truth. It is my prayer, gracious Father, that the Holy Spirit will come now, rule and reign over our service today. It is in the name of Christ we pray. Amen.
21st chapter Matthew 21 I hope you have your Bibles and are prepared to read along with me Matthew 21 we will start at the first verse are you there all right let us begin and when they drew nigh unto Jerusalem and were come to Bethage unto the Mount of Olives then sent Jesus Two disciples, saying unto them, Go into the village over against you, and straightway ye shall find an ass tied, and a coat with her. Loose them, and bring them unto me. And if any man say aught unto you, ye shall say, The Lord hath need of them, and straightway he will send them. All this was done that it might be fulfilled, which was spoken by the prophet, saying, Tell ye the daughter of Sion, Behold, thy king cometh unto thee, meek and sitting upon an ass, and a coat the foal of an ass. And the disciples went and did as Jesus commanded them, and brought the ass and the coat, and put on them, their clothes, and they set him thereon. 
And a great, very great multitude spread their garments in the way. Others cut down branches from the trees and strode them, strode them in the way. No. And the multitudes that went before and that followed cried, saying, Hosanna to the son of David. Blessed is he that cometh in the name of the Lord. Hosanna yeah. in the highest. And when he was come into Jerusalem, all the city was moved, saying, Who is this? Well, I have read for you from the book of Matthew, starting with chapter 21, verses 1 through 11. May the Lord add a blessing to your hearts for the hearing of his precious word. Amen. Let us pray. O oh Lord, <laughs> our Lord, how excellent is thy name in all the earth. Eternal God, our Heavenly Father, we are so thankful that you have blessed us to see another palm Sunday morning. Yes, Lord. The Sunday that Jesus rode triumphantly yes. into the city of Jerusalem. We thank you, Father God, for another week's journey. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for bringing us through the scene and the unseen danger yes. in our lives. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. For your loving kindness and your tender mercy. Yes, God. Thank you, Lord. That you've shown toward each one of us. We come on this Palm Sunday morning, first of all, to confess our sins. And it is my prayer, gracious Father, that you would wash all of us thoroughly from our iniquities and cleanse us from every stain of sin. Father, we do want to do what's right and we want to do what's pleasing yes. in your holy sight. We come this morning, Father God, realizing that we're living in perilous times. But I'm so glad that you are the Prince of Peace. Yes. Yes, you are. And you can bring peace in the midst of all of this confusion. Yes, you can, Lord. Pray, Father God, that you would move into the White House and bless our president who's trying to lead the country in the right way. Yes, Lord. Pray for the Congress and the Senate. But there's so much division. Have mercy. But I know, God, that you can bring togetherness in the, in the midst of all of that confusion. We realize that democracy has been threatened on every hand. But, Father God, I pray that you would bring peace in the midst of all of this confusion. Oh, yes, Lord. We pray, Father God, that there will be no riots in the streets. We pray, Father God, that you will let the world know that you are the ruler of this world. Yes, you are, God. Let the world know that you're King of Kings mm -hmm. and that you're Lord of Lords. And you've told us in your word that we should have no other God before you. Father God, I pray this morning for all of our senior citizens. Yes, Lord. Many of our senior citizens are living alone. But I'm praying that all day and all night your holy angels would encamp in their homes and minister yes, Lord. 
to their every need. Pray, Father God, that you would touch our sick this morning. There are many sick, many in the hospitals, many in rest homes, many in convalescent rehabilitation centers, God, but wherever they are, I know there's enough healing in the hem of your garment to heal all of the sick. Those who are in pain, pray you would ease their excruciating pain, God. In the name of Jesus. I know you are a divine healer. Yes, sir. And Father God, I pray this morning for our young people. I know that Satan has a desire to sift our young people as we. He wants to destroy them. Yes, Lord. But I'm praying, God, that you would save our young people from yes, everlasting punishment. Mm. Pray, Father God, that you would just help our young people to realize that they need you in their lives. Oh, yes. Yes, you told all of us to seek you first in your kingdom mm -hmm. and your righteousness. And then all other things will be added unto us. Pray, God, that you would stop so much killing. Yes, Lord. Take out stony hearts and replace hearts with love. Yes, Lord. Your love. Because you said if any man be in Christ, he is a new creature. Yes, Lord. We pray for those that are lost this morning who are in sin. Pray that they will come to you and confess their sins so they can be forgiven. They can start a new life yes, sir. in Christ Jesus. Pray for every church that's been planted by your divine hand. Yes, Lord. Pray for every God called and ordained minister. Pray that they will preach the gospel in its fullness. Yes, sir. And we'll be sure to give you the glory, give you the honor, and give you all of the praise. This is your servant's prayer. In Jesus' name, amen. You're the center of my joy. All that's good and perfect comes from you. You're the heart of my contentment, hope for all I center of my joy. Amen. Hymn of Adoration. Sing that again. 
is going down but it's still present and I encourage everyone to still wear your mask when you go in large crowds and and uh, continue to do your so six feet social distancing and wash your hands often yes masks are still required if you plan to attend every our services at Riddle Grove Baptist Church your safety is our first priority mm -hmm. today it's Palm Sunday, uh -huh. which marks the beginning of Holy Week. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I want to encourage everyone listening to me this morning to be as good as you can be next week. <laughs> next week is Holy Week. Yeah. Amen. Amen. <laughs> I encourage everyone to meet us next Sunday morning for our Easter service at Riddle Grove mm -hmm. Baptist Church, 6149 Old Smith Road in Stanhope, yes. North Carolina. Amen. Resurrection Sunday. Mm -hmm. I have a very special announcement. On the fourth Sunday in April, we will celebrate our annual S. Anna Allen Day. Amen. Great soldier of the cross. Mm -hmm. God blessed her to live to be 101 years old. Amen. And we want to celebrate Sister Anna for being so gracious to the Red Oak Grove Baptist Church. Yes. And so Amen. we're going to honor her Amen. on that special day. Yes, sir. Sister Darlene T. Eben will be our guest speaker. Amen. And the music will be rendered by the Mass Choir. Yes. Our special thought for today is Praise mm -hmm. releases more blessings. 
Amen. Praise yes. releases more blessings. Yes, sir. Please continue to pray for our sick and our shut in, Sister Aretha Spates. Amen. Sister Dorothy Carpenter, who had surgery on this week. We pray mm -hmm. for healing for her. Yes, Lord. Dr. Linda Tabor and Sister Doris Lucas. Mm -hmm. And please pray for Sister Evara Lucas, who will be having foot surgery. Mm -hmm. We pray that her surgery will go well. Amen. Please pray for Reverend Roosevelt Winstead. As you know, he's in Greenville, the hospital there. He had surgery. Yes. Uh, this week, and uh, we are praying for his healing. Amen. We're praying yes. for his healing. It's um, very difficult when you had the kind of surgery that he's had to just jump back overnight. But we're yes. praying. We're praying that God will deliver him. Amen. And put him back on his feet. Amen. Yes. Amen. Amen. Please continue to pray for Brother Leon Tabern, Brother Frankie Tony, Brother J.C. Morgan, Brother Milton Lucas, uh, Brother Barbara L. Tabern, yes, Brother LaRue Davis, mm -hmm. Reverend Matthew Wiley, yes, sir. Brother Bruce Boyd, and yes. Brother James Davis. Mm -hmm. Please keep all of these people in your prayers. Yes. Let us now prepare for the word for the morning. As uh, First Lady will come with the Samanic Selection. Oh, let's give God praise. Amen. <coughs> Hosanna. <coughs> as they shouted Hosanna as he came in on the donkey. Amen.
To God be the glory for the great and marvelous things that He's doing right now in each one of our lives. Yeah. From the scripture that First Lady read this morning, Matthew 21, 1 through 11, I want to lift up this last verse. Verse 11 for our text for the morning. And when mm -hmm. he was come into Jerusalem, mm -hmm. yes. all the city was moved, mm -hmm. saying, Who is this? And the multitude said, This is Jesus, yes. the prophet of Nazareth, of Galilee. Amen. This morning, the sermon involves a great question. Who is this? Who is That's what I want to preach about. That's I want to try to answer that question for everyone on this Palm Sunday. Who is this? Who is this? Today, on Palm Sunday, Many years ago, on that first Palm Sunday, it marked Jesus' last week mm -hmm. of his earthly ministry. Jesus knew that his time to be delivered into the hands of his enemies mm -hmm. was drawing nigh. Yeah. He had told his disciples on two previous occasions that he must go to Jerusalem uh -huh. and that there he would be turned over to the religious leaders. Yes. He went on to tell them that he would be ridiculed, tortured, tried, mm -hmm. and convicted, and finally be crucified on a Roman cross. Amen, yes. The disciples really didn't understand Jesus' ministry mm -hmm. and mission on earth. Mm -hmm. Peter even attempted to talk Jesus out of going to Jerusalem. But Jesus remained obedient to the will of the Heavenly Father. Amen. Yes. The text says, when they drew nigh unto Jerusalem mm -hmm. and were come to Bethage, unto the Mount of Olives. Jesus sent two of his disciples ahead of the rest of the group yes. to make the necessary arrangements for his entrance into the holy city of Jerusalem. Mm -hmm. He told them to go into the village and you will find an ass tied and a coat with her. Uh -huh. Loose them and bring them to me. Mm -hmm. And if any man. Yes. Say all unto you. Yeah. Ye shall say the Lord. Uh -huh. Have need of them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. When the two. Disciples returned with the animals. The disciples placed their cloaks. On the coat for Jesus to sit upon. Uh -huh. The stage was now set for Jesus' last trip to Jerusalem. As he reached the outskirts of the city, a large crowd began to gather around him. Mm -hmm. They started shouting praises unto him yes, they and called him the son of David. Yeah. Yes. Many in the crowd on that first Palm Sunday took off their coats. Uh -huh. While others cut down branches from the trees and strode them in the way. Yes. This was their way of honoring Jesus. All of this shouting. Uh-huh. Hosanna in the highest. Yes. All of this noise created a stir in the city. 
Well, the text for the morning in the 11th verse says, and when Jesus came into Jerusalem, uh -huh. all the city was moved, uh -huh. saying, who is this? Yes. And the multitude said, uh -huh. this is Jesus, yes. the prophet of Nazareth of Galilee. Yeah. Amen. Not only did they wonder about who Jesus was, mm -hmm. I'm sure they questioned his purpose for coming to Jerusalem. Yes. Church, I need to remind you who was in that crowd on the first Palm Sunday. All right. The first crowd that was there were the Zealots. Yes. The Zealots believed Jesus was the long-awaited political leader uh -huh. who would lead the revolt against the Roman Empire. They were loyal to their Jewish heritage, mm -hmm. but they despised the Romans. Yes. The Zealots have seen Jesus perform many miracles, mm -hmm. but they did not understand God's purpose for sending Jesus into the world when Jesus refused to be their political leader. Mm -hmm. They changed their opinion of him. And no doubt, their Hosanna praise changed mm -hmm. to crucify him. Just like many today, many see Jesus as someone who can be a leader for their cause. They don't care about his teachings. All right. The next group in the crowd that day was the Jewish religious leaders, uh -huh. the Pharisees and the Sadducees. Mm -hmm. They too were threatened yes. by Jesus' teaching. Mm -hmm. They were always trying to trap Jesus to say something they could use against him. Uh -huh. They knew the law of Moses, yes. but they did not recognize Jesus as the Messiah. They saw Jesus as a troublemaker, mm -hmm. and they wanted to kill him. Yes, they did. The third group in the crowd was the ruling Roman authorities. Uh -huh. At first, the Romans didn't pay much attention to Jesus. They said he was just a religious fanatic. But the religious leaders were making false accusations about Jesus, uh -huh. which forced them the Romans to take a second look at Jesus. The Romans noticed the popularity Jesus was gaining with the people. Yes. So they thought he might pose a serious threat to their stability. So they wanted to kill him also. The next group in the crowd recognized Jesus as a prophet of God. They heard him teach yeah. and perform miracles, mm -hmm. but they failed to listen to his call mm -hmm. to repent. Yes. Some of these same people are living today. Amen. These people refuse to accept Jesus as the Son of God. Mm -hmm. But thanks be to God, well. there was one final group in the crowd on that first Palm Sunday morning. A small group of believers yes. who recognize Jesus as the Messiah. Mm -hmm. This last group was willing to follow Jesus at any cost. Mm -hmm. He came as a king, mm -hmm. a humble king, a victorious king, yes. a king of peace. Uh -huh. The king entered the city for the Passover, the last Passover of the Old Covenant. Uh -huh. In a few days, he would make the Passover something new. Well, The sacraments of his body and blood, yes, sir. in a few days, he would give his life yes, sir. as God's lamb. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let me close this morning, lest I keep you too long. On that first Sunday, when Jesus entered the city, well, the crowd that went before him mm -hmm. and the crowd that followed after him uh -huh. 
started shouting Hosanna, Hosanna. to the son of David. Mm -hmm. They were praising Jesus yes. because of his mighty works. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And when God does something for you, All right. it will cause you to make some noise. Yeah. Amen. Do I have a witness? Yes, sir. Red Oak Grove, we can cry Hosanna uh -huh. because the Lord has done some great things for us. Amen. Yes, He has. He made a way yes, sir. out of no way. Yes. He has unlocked some doors yes, sir. that were closed in our face. Oh, yes, He has. He's been uh -huh. a doctor yeah. in our sick room. Yes, sir. He's been a shelter Lord. in the time of our storm. Yes. He's been a bridge yes, sir. over our troubled waters. Uh -huh. The crowd was making so much noise that day. Yes. The Pharisees called out to Jesus uh -huh. and told him, you need to make those folk be quiet. Yes. But Jesus uh -huh. told, give the crowd Hold their peace. Yeah. The rocks Rock. will cry out. Yes, yes. And I don't know how you feel about it. Right. And I know this is not good English. Right. But I want to testify for J.B. Woodhouse. Uh -huh. Ain't no rock. Ain't no rock. I said ain't no rock. rock. Going to cry out for me. Right. God has been too good. Yes, and I can't keep quiet. Yes. I shout. Yes. High Hosanna yes. to the highest. Yes, sir. You see, Hosanna uh -huh. is a Hebrew word yeah. which means Lord save. Uh -huh. Save us yes. from our sins. Who was in that crowd uh -huh. on the first Palm Sunday? Well, I believe the blind man was in the crowd right, whose sight was restored. Yes. Who was in the crowd? Uh -huh. I believe the man that was lame, yes. but now he could walk, uh -huh. was in the crowd. I believe yes, the deaf man that who couldn't hear, right, yes. but now his hearing yes. has been restored. Uh -huh. I believe he was in the yes. crowd, yes. waving his palm branch, yes. saying Hosanna. Yes. Who was in the crowd that day? Yes. I believe it was the lady. Yeah. With the issue of blood uh -huh. for 12 long years. Yes, sir. Jesus healed her. Yes, I believe she was in that crowd yes. shouting Hosanna. Hosanna. I believe yes. the man yes, that was delivered yes. from a legion of demons yes, was in the crowd yes, shouting Hosanna. Hosanna. I believe yes, Jairus and his daughter yes, that was raised from the dead yes. was in the crowd. Yes. Shouting Hosanna. Yeah. I believe yeah. the woman at the well yes, was there. Yeah. I believe yes, the centurion servant yeah. was there yeah. who received his healing yeah. on that first Palm Sunday. Yeah. The text said when Jesus came into the city, yeah. all the city was moved. Yeah. Asking, Who is this? And I want to ask you, Red Oak. Do you know him this morning? Yes, if you know him, yes. you can shout. You can shout yes. because without a doubt, he is the foundation yes. that never shakes. Yes. You can shout this morning because he's the truth that never lies. Yes, you can shout you, because he's the light yes. that never grows dim. Yes, you can shout no, because he's the beginning. Yes that has no end. You can shout because he's help that never hinders. You can shout because he's our strength in our weakest moment. You can shout because he's a judge that never misjudges. If you really know Jesus, why don't you give him some praise? Don't let nobody stop you from praising him. You don't have to be in the church this morning, yeah. but right in your house, yeah. right in your living room, yeah. right in your kitchen, yeah. right in your bathroom, yeah. you can shout Hosanna, oh, you can give God the praise, Hosanna. don't let nobody, yeah. I said don't let nobody 
stop you from giving God yes, what's due Him. Amen. All glory. Yes, I said all glory. All, all glory. All, all glory. All, all honor, honor yes. belong to Him. To the hymn number yeah, 12 in your hymn book says, yeah. Praise Him. Praise Him. Praise him. Praise Jesus, him. our blessed Redeemer. Yeah. Sing. O earth, his wonderful love proclaim. Hail him. I said, Hail him. Highest archangel in glory, strength, and honor. Give to his holy name. Like a shepherd, Jesus will guard his children. In his arms, he carries them all day long. Praise him. I said, Praise him. Praise him, Red Oak. Yes, God has been good. You, Praise him. Praise Tell him. of his excellent grace. Yes. Praise him. Yes. I said, Praise him yes. on this Palm Sunday. Yes. You ought to give God a shout of praise. Is he all right? Has he been good to you? Yes. Has he made a way for you? Yes. Has he done things for you? Yes. Has God been good? Yes. Didn't he wake you up this morning? Yes. Glory in the right mind. Yes. You ought to give God the glory. Yes. Because when I think about, yes. I wish I had one witness. Yes. I said, when I think about, yes. I said, when I think about, yes. when I think about yes. the goodness of Jesus yes. and all he done for me. My soul, my soul, cries out, hallelujah, on this Palm Sunday. The song said, lift up your heads, O ye gates, and be ye lifted up, ye everlasting doors, and let the King of glory come in. O Palm Sunday, let him in your heart. O Palm Sunday, let Jesus in. Lift him up, lift him up, lift him up. Give him the praise. Do you know who he is? Yes, sir. The summer says, Who is this? Who is this? I tell you who he is. Yes. He's King of Kings. So nice. He's Lord of Lords. Lord Lord. He's my everything. Yes, sir. Couldn't do nothing without him. Yes, sir. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you, Lord, for being so good to me. We got one this morning out of the Ark of Safety. I extend to you the gospel invitation yes, so that you can really know Thank you, God. who Jesus is yes, sir. on this Palm Sunday morning. Mm -hmm. Everybody, under the sound Thank of my voice, God. you ought to be lifting up your praise yes, sir. right now and giving God the glory, giving, the honor. giving Him the honor for all that He's done. Yes, sir. He's done so much for me. Yes. I just can't tell it all. Yes, Lord. The hymn writer said, if I had 10,000 tongues, yes, I couldn't thank God enough yes, for all that he's done. Amen. Amen. Yes, Lord. And thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Come Lord. on, First Lady. Thank you, Lord. Yes, sir. Oh, yes. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Who is thank this? Hey, who is this? Yes. Uh, his name is Jesus. Yes, he is. Savior of the world. Yeah, yeah. Savior of my soul. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, the one who picked me up. Yeah. Turned me around. Yes, yeah, Washed it. me white as snow. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Who is this? Yes. The Son of God. Oh, yeah. Jesus is the answer. Yes, he is. For the world today. Above him there's no other Jesus is the way Jesus is the answer For the world today yes. Above him there's no other For Jesus is the way
morning. Yes, he is. Amen. Thank you so much for tuning in this morning. May God bless you. I want to thank First Lady for the music. Thanks to Sister Evans for the instrumental music. Yes. And so happy to have my grandson, Dee Dee, uh, visiting with us this morning for our service. Yes. And I pray that all of you will have a great week. And don't forget, next week is Holy Week. Uh -huh. Amen. 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 May God bless you. Please meet us in the sanctuary next Sunday morning, Resurrection morning at 11 a.m. for the Resurrection Sunday. Have a great week and may God bless you. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord calls his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. The Lord is countenance upon each one of you and give you peace, both now and forevermore. Amen. Amen. You've heard the word of God coming through God's man servant. Let the church say amen, everybody. Amen. Amen. God has spoken. Amen. Let the church say amen.